Whoa. Okay, let's play F6. Let's, you know, Benjamin says don't do F6. He says don't do a lot of things, so let's ignore every single thing that Benjamin has ever said. If you're 33 years old, I think a reasonable goal uh, is probably not to play online because undoubtedly you're married, you have a family, you have other commitments like a job as well. But if you're 33 and you're starting, I think your goal online should be to get to like 12, 12 or 1300, assuming you start off from, from 400 level. Like 12, 1300, maybe 1500, somewhere around there, I think is realistic. But, but just make sure you enjoy it. That's the most important thing. When I was younger and growing up, because the computers were nowhere near where they are now, I would say up until about 2300 level, I loved chess. It was just pure, it was fun. I knew my basic openings. That was that. I just played as much as I could online, over the board, etc. Um, So I like, that's what I did. But but after about 2300, when it became much more about like knowing a lot of different openings, other stuff like that, I, I kind of, it, it, was, it was still obviously challenge and fun, but it wasn't pure fun the way it was prior to that. We're going to play a Kings in attack against Mr. Cuba. By the way, I hope this dude's okay because... Speaking of Cuba, um, they, they're probably getting absolutely whopped by uh, by by the by the hurricane. I think nowadays it's not twenty three hundred though because nowadays okay this dude seems to he seems to be moving very fast like he's actually studied this line or something. I'm kind of confused. Um, but nowadays like even at twenty one hundred you have to be you have to know a lot more theory than you did back then. Beep, up, 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 up. 16k after magazine maybe 30k i don't know i'm just grateful to all you guys for love and support you're all amazing so thank you so much go here okay this is a classic fisher setup in the king's any attack for me here the 94 is a good move we go here trade some pieces I could have traded and gone knight issue knight f3 too. That might have been better, but whatever. Who cares? Just chess after all. I really do think I should have traded, but that's life. I think there's a Maverick death for the five. I think Acanthus for the 100 bits. Thank you so much. Okay, I'm going to go here in G4 though. But you're better than Fisher. That's true. I played better than Fisher in Gibraltar, right? In 2017. I mean, it's going to be very interesting to see what happens with the whole, the, that function out of chess space, that let's check feature. Cause like, I'm going to be honest, like, I don't really believe that that's a, that's a way of measuring cheating. Um, but if, but if the stats are as skewed as they appear to be, as, as they appear to be, I, I feel like there is a lot of credence, a lot more credence to it than I would have thought. Because like when I look at my best games, I'm seeing like 75s and 80s, and then like I'm seeing hundreds out of Hans. It does actually make me kind of wonder. Like it makes me step back and think for a second. Um take. I mean rookie three looks beautiful. Yeah, let's just go all in with the big, big attack. Any sort of map over for the give a sub. Ravma for the 21 months. Appreciate it. I should switch cards to Ikea now that I'm playing the setup every game. True. True. I don't think this is ending with an apology for Magnus. I don't think it is. I highly doubt it, in fact. I would say the, the odds of that are like 5%. If that. If that. I guess I'll go here. Just stack the two towers. Because I assume he's going to play F6. But then he has to deal with problems on the E file. That's my assumption, at least. Goes for G8. Now I could take and play E6, but actually no, I go here because now F6 I take and he loses the juicer. Rook B8 was a very poor move. I do seriously think you and quite a few others are better than Fisher. Well, of course we're better than Fisher because we have advantages that he didn't have. We have computers, we have databases, we have all these resources that simply did not exist back then. Of course I'm going all in with the big attack. I mean, of course we're better, but that, that's not really saying much because he had to do it with a lot less. Let's go here. Maybe just queen f4. I mean, this has to be just GG's pretty soon. I'm going to go here and knight g4. He's just getting absolutely sauced on the king side. Let's go here. I could trade. Anything wins, but I don't need to do anything. Um, work f3 wins. h6 wins. I'll just h6, h7. Rumor has it that it'll be you versus Ludd in, you versus Magnus in a Ludwig uh, boxing event. No, I mean, I was aware of it. During the candidates, Ludwig did ask me about it, but 
Nothing came of it. Okay, we got the win. Very good first game. Probably Magnus won too. Don't you want to stack championships? It's not not that big of a deal at this point, you guys. I mean, TwitchCon, I was going to go to it. And TwitchCon obviously would matter a lot more to me than... um Would matter a lot more to me than another US championship, if I'm being honest. Or at least at the time it would have. Now I don't know. Because now, I mean... Now, like, as I said, it seems like every streamer is stabbing each other in the back. So, <laughs> I mean, I'm not so sure I would want to go to TwitchCon, honest, honestly. Just play simple chess. I was supposed to play here in Queen C8. I played the wrong order. Um, play C5. Why not? Something different. Castle. Thanks for a big bozer for the five months. Thanks for a big bozer. Appreciate it. It was B3, almost 20k. I'm just chilling, you guys. I don't think about numbers. I, I think I would advise people if you're actually if you're interested in streaming, that's one of the biggest things. So here, one of the most important things to remember is that numbers are just numbers. You really cannot pay too much attention to them. Because like, I'll give you an example. I'll, I'll probably be streaming. I'll be streaming Thursday night football. I'll probably have like 4k watching. Which, um, wait. A1 CB7 takes Knight G5. Unfortunate. Let's have fun. Let's go 94. I don't know if it's right, but let's have fun. Um, yeah, I'll probably like four. Thank you, Akanthissa, for the bits. I'll probably have like 4K people watching. People will be like, you know, dead streamer this, dead streamer that. Like, you know, you, you, you just stream and you, you see you see how it goes. I'm going to play Knight G4. This might be wrong, but I'm going to do it anyway. I'm trying to get some kind of cheeky Queen of Five type stuff in here. Some kind of funky business. Oh, do I, can I go for a glory play? Knight of... Hmm. I want to go for glory, but I don't think it works. Is King G1, Queen F1, and he blocks... Ah. Oh, he blocks. Okay, it doesn't work. So I guess I'll just take with the... Oh, he's going to play E3, I guess. Maybe I have Queen F5 here? No, F... I guess I'll play Queen F5. Why not? I'm trying to get cheeky here a little bit probably i should have just gone back what it is things are actually yet d for the prime things are yet d appreciate it. thank you uh are you gonna stream the egg ball thing even after realizing you can't show the game it's a contractual commitment Yes, I will. Uh, I, I do have a contract. I'm streaming the first, first uh, or not first, but I'm streaming this week and next week for sure. I think it's just Shaughnessen for the 10 months. I think it's just Shaughnessen. Appreciate it. Thank you. Yeah, Queen of Three is a good move. I should not have allowed this, but nah, that's what it is. Oh, very poor play by me. Why did I go Queen of Five even? So stupid. Mucho stupido by me. Um, Do I have Queen C2? No, there's Rookie 2. Queen D3? No. Yeah, I didn't want to do this, but I kind of have to. This kind of is frustrating. Queen f5 was a bad move. I should have just gone bishop g7 right away. Okay, but she goes bishop e2, which... Play a6 here. Bishop e2 is a little bit dubious. Bishop g2 was just the best move by far. The e4 logical. b5 is a move. I'm just gonna go here. Oh wait, now there's bishop d4 again. Wait a second. Wait a second. This feels wrong somehow. Two. Somehow this feels wrong. I don't know how to punish it, but it feels wrong. I'm gonna go here. If a4, I guess. Uh, I don't know why I did this actually. Not have done this. Should have put the other rook on b8. Okay, whatever. Okay, let's reset. Be careful about my bishop too, actually. Okay, but that's got to be a mistake. I can check. I can play h5 whenever. I feel like there's got to be some b5 in here. Maybe bishop f2. 
just gonna go knight f6. Maybe just play h5, yeah. I can take, I can also take and play like h5. What, what what she's gonna do here angling for b5 here Go here. I'm probably gonna play b5 next move. She's got no time though, so it's gonna be very hard for her to defend this. And play b4 if I want. I think I'm just gonna go. If I go knight a6, do I play e5? Do I play f6? So many options here. I think I'm gonna go. Um, I'm just going to play F6. Okay, Rook G1 is not the best move, but still have to be careful how I do this. I'm going to go E5. Because now takes, I take, and I get the knight jump. Takes, I'm still getting a jump. Here should be better somehow. I was trying to put a knight on e3. Hmm, wait a second. Not trivial. Okay, I'm thinking too long here. But now my knight gets in, I mean. Go here, jump with the knight. And now this should be winning eventually. Yeah, now I take and I drop back easy. Mm hmm. There we go. Another one. Two out of two. Lo lobster meat, no date. Yeah, exactly. All right, let's go knight f3 again. Keep it simple. Just trying to play king's any attack every game, basically. Just keep it really, really basic. Magus is not... Wait, what? Wait, what is h6? Okay, fine. I'm going to go... Oh, he wants bishop f5. I'm such an... Such an idiot. I didn't realize that's what he wanted. Never mind. So stupid by me. Okay, I'll go here. Pressure on B7 here as well. Just, um, close castle, why not? I could have taken two. Maybe I should have. I don't know. It's all just chess. 50 move rule is if nothing is captured. Um, 50 moves, it's a draw. I think it's ordinary rotter for the tier one. Thank you so much. Uh, B7 wasn't free. I thought he had night before. I mean, again, I don't know, but yeah, he's going to take. Yeah, he takes, and I guess I'll just go a3 here to stop knight before. I could have played bishop f4 too. I think bishop f4 is probably a very good move here. I want to go like rook c1, rook d1, knight e5. Drop back. Go c6, I have knight e5, and then b4. This looks pretty good for me. I don't like knight a5 at all. Thanks so much at jci02 for the prime. Thanks so much jci, I appreciate it. Thank you. Magnus doesn't, I think, stream when he's playing these events. Oh, wait a second. That looks wrong. Wait. That looks wrong, but is there a way to punish it? Takes, takes. There. There. Takes, takes, takes. Takes, takes. Oh, this looks right to me. 
I hope I'm not blundering, but I don't think I am. Hopefully not. Piling up subs today. I haven't been looking at the sub count, but yeah. Yeah, thank you so much to everybody for the love and support. Y'all are amazing. Okay, 92 or not 92. This is correct to hit the uh, hit the queen. 95 was also completely reasonable. If he takes, I just take and take. I'm I'm, I'm should be doing fine here. Now, yeah, so he takes, I take of course. Now I have rook d1, rook c1, c7 is weak. Oh, I missed bishop. Oh my gosh, I didn't even see bishop e6. I'm so lucky that I beat through. I didn't even see bishop e6 at all. Yikes. Big yikes, actually. Big yikes. Very lucky I beat through. I didn't even see this move. Hmm. <laughs> Look at the ceiling. Yeah. That's one way of doing it. You have one job. Uh, what do you mean by I have one job? One job, one job, which is not blunder. Is that what I'm supposed to do? Yeah. Can you already see fatigue playing a factor? I mean, I am a little bit tired, but again, this I don't want a repeat of every Tuesday for the last like 20 years, which is that I, I start off reasonably fine and I just fall apart. Um, This looks good. Actually, I have Bishop E. We'll go. I don't even know which square I'm supposed to go to, honestly. I, I don't even know if there's a difference, but somehow the knight feels more secure on e5 and it covers g4. I'm going to go this way to go here. Knight a5, I mean, maybe there was some knight g4. I, I don't really know, but the knight just seems better here. Bishop c5. Okay, reasonable move. Go here to hit the bishop. Now, though, I feel like knight a, maybe knight a5 is better. I don't actually know. Bishop d5. Wait a second. Is that actually playable? Maybe it is. Let's take. So here, when a pawn plays like an L Magnus would. Getting too low on time. Now, queen f5 is a good move, but now I'm going to go here and force the queens off. And I should just be much, much better here. Yeah, it should just be winning. See eight. Now I can take with the bishop or the pawn or the rook. Somehow this seems right, just with like rook c1. B4. Wait a second. I think I just take though and go here. I'm just up two pawns. Two g4. Create a connect four. Stupid by me, but this is still winning, but eh. Go here. Should have created a bit of a flying V. I also have E5 here, maybe. It's not easy to win though. doing I should be winning here but I've really made this tricky on myself Here and now I'm just winning. He's cut off. 
Yeah, classic working pawn end game. So here, build the bridge. Pretty easy. Okay, we got the win. Three out of three. Tough game, but it's a win. Thank you so much, Daniel Machado, for the 21 Silver Surfer, for the Prime and Single Chen with the Prime. Three out of three. All right, good stuff. Actually, I guess my mod should find out if there's a break after round four or not. Yeah, mods, is there a break after round four? Or is it after round eight? Yeah, we got the win three out of three. Okay, Bornick won. Somebody else did not win. Was it Wesley who didn't win? Yeah, I mean, I'm on three out of three, so it's all good. I've watched it too much. I could predict the building the bridging and maybe back for the 19. Yeah. Careful not to have too high percentage of CPU moves. I'm not playing all that great. I'm pretty sure that last game I made like probably five really poor moves in the end game. Here's a slow mark for the prime, the Tico MP3 for the three minutes or for the uh for the for the prime. Thanks so much. Yeah. Three out of three, so it's all good so far. I've been streaming for about seven hours already at this point, so I've been streaming a long time, you guys. Thank you so much to Samiti for the 18 months. Thank you so much to Samiti. Appreciate it. Thank you for the 18 months, man. Glad Max played both. Yeah, we've had some pretty popping numbers today. Next event that's not the CGC. Um, I don't actually know. I mean, I have the CGC, but after that, I'm not sure. Like, if I qualify, I play that. Of course, there are probably more online games. But over the board, next event will be at the end of November in India. It'll be the Tata still rapid and blitz being held in India. Yeah, I guess Wesley lost the game. I saw Wesley, but yeah. Normally, your energy levels dip in the TD. How do you try to tackle this? Either I try to take like a one hour break before the event. Thank you so much, Chess Dev, for the 10 gifted. I try to take a break before the um I try to take a break for like an hour before just like close my eyes that's one way or I try to drink more coffee stuff like that yeah why isn't GM XQC in this tournament guess it wouldn't be fair for 4k juicer to play true this so much deny the guy for the tier one and spine syrup for the 22 things so much spine syrup Who do I have as my pick in the CGC era Aragaisi versus Rajbob I don't know I mean that's a tough match I mean, my instinct is that I got I got to go with Arjun. He's just uh, he's, he's just on um he's, he's just on a roll. So I got to go with Arjun. That's what I would say. Iceland will be October twenty fourth to thirtieth, I believe, somewhere around there. I don't have the exact dates because I haven't gotten a contract. I need a Bassy Lol for the tier one and Soda Boris for the prime. Need a Dark Star. Uh, as well, or Dark Star 81 for the seventh. You're anonymous for the get the sub. Okay, round four, the usual. Again, I want to win every game, so I'm just gonna keep playing G6 here. I happened to Iceland one time. I played the Reykjavik Open in 2004. It was Mark. Whoa. Okay, let's play F6. Let's. You know, Benjamin says don't do F6. He says don't do a lot of things. So let's ignore every single thing that Benjamin has ever said. Castles D6. Ooh, H4, aggressive. Um, whatever, let's play 97. I think I can go G5, right? Because I can just take and drop back. I don't know. Eh. I don't like H6, but I think I have to play it. I can play Knight F8, but I think just Castles and Knight F6 makes sense. Um, I guess I'll go here and Bishop B7. Knight h8 would be funny, but it loses to bishop h7. Just soothes the soul. I don't even know if this is good, but it's, it's exciting. It's excitingly different. e4 feels wrong somehow. I know e4 just doesn't seem right. Can't quite pinpoint. Ah, he has this idea. Ah. Okay, well, this is actually scary. So I'm going to go here in 94 then, I guess. I also play C6, but 94 must be right, because I can take and take. I still have C6 too. He wants to go 93 or something. The thing is, I can play Knight H8 here. I can also go A5, A4, A3. Hmm. I don't like my position, though. I'm going to go A5, A4, maybe just attack. Might not be right, but it seems reasonable. 
soothes the soul. Oh, uh, yeah, I go here, target the knight. I mean, I always have a4, a3, too, which I'm almost certainly going to play. I'm going to go a4 here. And probably a3, too. Oh, wait. Take. Oh, did I just... No, I thought I blundered for a second, but... No, I didn't blunder. Okay, wait a second. Still very tricky. I have to be very careful how I do this. Pieces are a little bit misplaced. I don't want to take with a bishop. I don't want to take with a knight either. Or I... Okay, don't choke this away like every other Tilted Tuesday. Let's go C5. Lock it up. And play rook a2 and take Let's see my knight is really good on d4 so that's, i'm just trying to over protect it here thank you so much to anonymous for the gift of sub thank you so much shy guy for the nine and zach winter for the 44 months This isn't great, but I think it's okay. I mean, I kind of have to take. Go here. Question is, do I play King H7 or not? I don't like going to H7, but I think this idea of H7 and activating the Rook is very scary. So I'm just going to go to H7. Or like Rook A2 maybe. Maybe b5 and attack too. Takes interesting. I don't want to take with a c palm, but I think I have to. It's not really what I wanted at all. Although I can maybe go d5. Actually, maybe I have d5 here. Takes, I can take, take, take. Messy. So I take and then I take. Of course, he finds that. Now I have problems. <sighs> Frustrating. Or do I? If Queen G6. Be very careful how I play this. Go here. Thanks for the Underworld God. Thank you, Dizo and R6 Paradox as well. Thank you so much. I think I'm okay here. Yeah. Because H6, I just go Queen A5. There's nothing. I just take and go over, and I'm fine, I think. Oh my gosh, he found this? Ah, it's just a draw now. I don't think I have anything, let me think. I think I just go here and it's a draw. Frustrating. I mean, if I go e4, I have nothing. d3, rook h8 is just losing. Yeah, I have to make a draw. Or wait, is queen of five actually... Yeah, I think it's... It's just a draw. I'm 
Wait, did I just blunder? No, it's still a draw. Yeah, nothing I can do, just a draw. Yeah, frustrating. I think there's a kid across the nation thinking Alaska chess. I mean, he did play that quite well. Oh no, Queen G2? Oh no. Oh, Queen G... Oh. oh my gosh, Queen G2? I didn't even think about... Oh my gosh. Wait, why is Queen G2... Oh, Queen G2 is winning because on the same line doesn't work. Because I think I'm winning here. I have a split pawn. Oh wait, no, I... Oh, yeah, yeah. Wow. That's insane. Let's keep going. So why is everybody suddenly playing like funky chess? I'm gonna play E4, fine, whatever, dude. I mean, this is nonsense. I can play H4, but I'm just gonna go Bishop C4. I'm gonna play like D6, I'll play C3, just consolidate. Oh, did I play this guy before? I think I played this guy, right? I think I did exactly this last time too. I did the same thing and I let him off the hook. I actually, I think I won the game, but it was not very good. I'm gonna play H3. I guess I'll go here on Bishop B3. Yeah, I, I remember this. I played this guy before. He did the same silly thing and I let him off the hook completely. Go here. I mean, if I play this well, I should just be winning out of the opening. Think of the Pella for the tier one. I think there's a rocket GW for the prime. Yeah, if I play this well, I should just be crushing. Now I can trade. I can also go Bishop G5 though, which looks very appropriate. At some point, I probably should consider E5, maybe even A4. But, I mean, he can't really castle to the king's side now. But we'll see. Takes as a move. I can play A4 also. A4 actually makes, I think, a lot of sense. I'm gonna play A4 here. Because now I'm gonna soften the soften the point so he can't play c5. Okay, because I wait, that looks insane. Wait a second. Wait a second, wait a second, wait a second. This just looks wrong. Wait a second. But I don't I don't want to blitz out too much. I'll just take and play here. Maybe queen d3, maybe knight e2. Again, probably at some point I should take, but it's a question of when. Probably I should have just traded right away. Okay, I think. I think now I'm going to take. He's going to take and we'll, we'll trade rooks. I'm going to go like queen d3 and maybe just knight e2 here. Feels very pleasant for me. Although it's that doesn't mean it's like winning or anything. Maybe queen e3 and knight e2 is better. I don't know. I think queen e3 is better because I kept more. But I'll go here. Thank you so much to uh, Drake for the prime. Thank you so much, Drake. Appreciate it. I can go F3, but I think keep it simple with Bishop C2. No need to get too too cheeky here. See, a strange move. Um, yeah, I think now he's going to get in trouble. Because now I think there are problems on the king side here. A like actual problems. Queen H4 is a big threat. Queen F4 is a big threat too. I can probably castle and go rook h1 even. I think I think my, my man is in trouble here. Doesn't mean it's like winning or anything, but this feels bad for black somehow. I'm just gonna go uh queen h4 king e7? No, I don't understand this. Maybe I just go like Okay, I'm thinking too long. Queen h4. Why not? Let's put pressure on this this knight. A lot of pressure here. And if he can't do anything on the queen side. He's, he's sort of paralyzed on the king side here. Whoa, queen d8? Wow. Um, That looks wrong. Do I go f4, g3? I think I'm going to go to g3. This looks pretty scary for black. Yeah, I think I'm just probably winning, actually. he's He's got big problems on the king side here. What? heck this must be losing somehow i don't quite know how but this must be losing okay he goes there 
I mean, e5 is a move. But I think I can just chill. I can just play like knight of 193. I just chill here. I'll go here. I mean, he's got this big problem with this pin that he can't really deal with. He goes e5. I mean, 93 Phil's winning. If this isn't winning, I mean, I can also just go d5. Actually, d5. Actually, this is just very easy because he still can't. He can't break the pin. Knight c5. I just go bishop d1. Yeah, he's just done, and not just in this game. Thank you so much to the second ethon for the five bucks and Bloom Dude for the tier one. Thank you so much to Bloom Dude. Appreciate it. Thank you. Yeah, this is over. <laughs> yeah. Not just in this game, yeah. There's nothing you can do. I mean, the pin just sends the game. So like here, you can play B3 and I go Bishop B1. Doesn't change anything. They still, he can't break the pin. Max is gonna draw. Okay. I think Knight D2 just cleans it up very neatly. Everything's guarded here. Okay, we got the win. Four and a half out of five. Good win. Uh, we get to play MSB. This is Matthias Bluebaum. We're on four and a half out of five. Good score so far. Not many people on five, so... Play the Dutch again. Right, he always plays this line. Okay, I'm going to go here in Bishop G8. Thank you so much to Millsad for the 14 months. Okay, plays there. I mean, I assume I should play Bishop G8 just to get the bishops in the corner here. Back to that. I can play A6. Knight D7 also seems pretty reasonable. A6 a threat is the big question. I'm going to play A6. I don't know if it's right. It was B5. I expected that. Go here, maybe. Oh, I could have taken a pawn. What the heck? Idiot. I could have just taken... Ah, that's so stupid by me. That's just a free pawn. So stupid. Um, let's play h6. And what am I doing here? I can just take and... So stupid. Magnus drew that game, yes. I mean, rook g8's a move. c5 is also a move that I think I should consider... I think c5 makes a lot of sense. Just to lock in the bishop here so he can't push and attack. Yeah, I think a c5 is actually a very important move that I just played. Now, rook b8's a move. Bishop f7. Also, king h7 also a move. I'm just going to go here, guard the pawn just to be safe. Bishop h7 was maybe a move too, but I feel like there's some tricks with knight d5 somewhere in here. He plays H for expected that. Now, 94 over the 95. Over here, I guess. Probably play Rook B8 next move, depending what he does. I like my position, though. I'm pretty happy with this. Magus on 4.5 out of 5, too. Yeah. Plays rook b2. I expect I'll go here to trade some rooks. Also, I had 94 there, which I should have. Oh no, there's still 95. I keep forgetting. Rook c2, strange move. Not a move that I. I guess he wants 95 or something. I'll go here. Now I put pressure on d4 and I guard everything. Strange move. I don't understand rook c2 at all.
I mean, did he just miss bishop b3? I think he just missed bishop b3 completely. And queen h4, I think I have bishop f6 too, which is another important move in between. Hmm, still not trivial, but okay, this should be good. Yeah, queen g3 takes, takes, rook c8, takes, rook e8. It's got to be winning. To give up who we are. Things which uh, did Bugu for the eight months. A little Emadej for the tier one. Okay, so now I just take, of course. Oh, he just oh he just takes. I did not expect that. Um, I want to take with the knight or the pawn is also a question. Somehow I think I should just take with the knight. This should be winning eventually for me. Yeah, he has 95 though, and it's still a little bit tricky. Be a little bit careful how I play. So I have a pass pawn though. So have queen c7 somewhere in here. Uh, I think I go here, try to trade some queens. I think as long as I control the two open lanes, I should be fine. Or two open files, sorry, not the lanes. This isn't this isn't uh, Valorant. Thank you so much for photo mob for the six and collab for the gifted sub. That looks like a blunder. Wait. Wait a second. Do I play rook? Wait, I have rook d8 first, I think. Of course, why did I do that? That was not correct. Why did I do that, actually? What the heck? Wait, do I have rook? Wait, rook d6, rook b8. Oh, wait, no, this is still winning. Wait. No, this is still winning because I have this. I have check and double stack. Yeah, I, I have the double stack, so I win. Double stack on the back rank. Game over. Rook f6 wasn't bad, but he has queen e5, queen f3. So I go check, and then I go stack, and GG's. He's really not going to resign. Okay, there we go. We got another win. Five and a half out of six. Another good game. Okay. Okay, so I get Joppies on five and a half also. And Drew Magnus. Um what I I I I mean I'm on a good score. I don't okay. I, eh. Ah, who cares? Let's have fun. If it's no good, it's no good. Let's let's have fun. I'm taking a big risk by playing the modern. What I think of XQC's tweet, I already covered that. Um what it is if he, if he wants to like get on a call and yell at me for five hours so be it um this is probably bad but i'm gonna do it anyway Oh, on Dragon Loss on time? Ouch, okay. But somehow what I did is not particularly attractive. Um, Like, really not attractive. I might get actually just smoked in this game. This is actually really bad. This looks really bad for me. Um, yeah, I castle. Go here. So I have D5 here, which is a move. I think I've got to do it because takes I take with check and then d5 h5 I just take 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 and I should be fine it's gonna be wild I also have f6 maybe I 
I forgot he could even take that way. Jeez. Yeah, I completely forgot he could take with a C pawn. I'm losing my mind. Okay, he goes bishop d3. Wait a second. I might have some miracle here. Like, I have h6 maybe? Gotta think here. I think he missed a win. I'm almost sure, certain that he missed a force win there. So this is where I have a chance if I can find something. Five knight of eight, e4, queen e3. That's bad. Six. I, think I have to do this. Only move. This looks really bad for me. Wait, where'd he move? Oh, he played queen g3, so I didn't even see his move. So I take his h6, but then bishop f6. And I'm probably just getting absolutely killed in this game, but... F6, bishop a6. I, I have to find a move, though. Don't have time either. This is so unpleasant. I <sighs> gotta find a move. I think he blundered. I don't know what h6 was. He was supposed to take the pawn. I think he missed bishop f6 d8, actually. I think he just missed it. He can't capture. I'm back in the game, but it's still very spicy. Bishop a6 too, though. I think I'm okay, actually. I think I'm okay. Yeah, so I get king h7, I just win the game. Okay. Think, think. No quick moves here. Heck is rook h5. Wait, I can take and go bishop g4, but you know, why am I even... No, let's just go here, get rid of the bishops. I, I don't know if this is good or not, but it's just like, why do I want to be stupid here? I mean, I, I the rook h5 is very creative, but what's the point? I mean, I just got to get rid of the pieces. I get rid of the pieces, I win the game. It's that simple. But now I just go here and I just win. I just win the game now. Because now I blockade, I cover everything. There we go. We're going to get the win. Big, big win. Although I actually shouldn't celebrate too soon. So, wait, wait, wait. F5. Let's go here. Still is F5 is a trick. Should be winning. H7 is a still a threat. Wait, how do I bring my pieces in? Um... Uh... 
Why am I thinking so long? Okay, but now I just win. Yeah, now I just cover up. There we go. Big win.